Hello, fourth graders, or almost fifth graders. It's officially June. After this month, you will be fifth graders. Actually, by the 19th, after the 19th, you will be fifth graders. Congratulations for making it this, this far. But we still have work to do. So I'm writing today. This is um, what I posted on the course page last week. And I just wanted to go over the writing part. It says, later today we'll be post writing video number six. If you've not watched that, you need to watch that one because it has a lot of great information on how to write your first two chapters and your introduction. And so I wrote here, this video will explain how, more how students should write or type out their country report. And I just want to make a comment. You can type it if you want. And if you want to send it <clears throat> to me, you can be, email it now. Um, once your emails get set up and, and running or a parent can email it or you can text it to me, take a picture of it. Remind them, um, uh, this is to your parents, so remind them not to copy everything word for word. So uh, if you're working on that later today, you wanna be sure, or tomorrow or this week, you wanna make sure that you're putting it in your own words and not just copying down everything that you have found online or from any of your sources. So once again, the introduction, I, I, you wanna put that with a hook in it to get people's attention. You also want to um, kind of find a, a way to keep your reader interested. So please uh, put some work into that. I look forward to reading them. Uh, and then in this video today, we're going to talk more about text boxes and fun facts text boxes and how you can add color and just make your um, country report more interesting. Okay. So here I've Show, I've used color and I just took my notebook, which I know you have your uh, book that I gave you that has paper in it. You could simply just start it in there if you have some the crayons I gave you or if you have other markers around. Here's a fun fact box, text box about Australia. And you can see I wrote fun facts about Australia. And my first point, bullet point says 90% of Australia's live on the coast. So almost everybody lives on the border of uh, the continent or the country of Australia. The largest ecosystem in the world is the Great Barrier Reef. And I have an arrow that kind of points to what I was attempting to do, which is draw Australia. And you can see it's kind of in the northeast section of the continent. Tasmania has the cleanest air in the world. I just found these interesting. The Australian Alps which are the mountains, get more snow than the Swiss Al Alps, which are in Switzerland. And people think of Switzerland as being a very cold and snowy place and a famous place for skiing and so forth. But so I found these interesting facts um, in my research and I just put them together into this little fun text box. And so you can do the same. So here I'm finishing up another text box, and this one is called Weird and Inter Interesting Facts About Australia. So I'm doing this nifty little border, just being fun and silly. And some people call this a did you know text box because it's, uh, you know, maybe facts that are a little bit different and that people might find surprising. And I'm so interested in finding out whatever country you selected, which uh, facts you came up with. So here we go. Australia has three times more sheep than people. Did you know Australia is home to all of the 25, uh, or to, sorry, to 21 of the 25 most venomous snakes? So watch out. It is home to the world's longest golf course, which is more than 850 miles long. That sounds interesting. I'd want to know more. Also, if you were to visit one new beach in Australia every day, it would take over 27 years to see them all. That's 365 days times 27. Oh, goodness. That's 9,855 Beaches. That's incredible. Okay, so now you know how to do um, text boxes, which would be like on fun facts or interesting facts or fact boxes, you could even call them. 
And so I would just encourage you to look online. I just simply even said weird things about Australia and I was able to find different things as I Googled it. So hopefully you can get those, put those in. Um, you know, this can be cut out and, and can be placed um, maybe below part of one of my chapters. I could glue it down or staple it down or tape it down. Um, or you could just, as you're continuing to, you've probably been drafting your first two chapters. Uh, and after you've done your introduction and put that in final form, you could even write in the middle of one of your chapters, you could put this, this fun fact um, box in, text box, and then that's just another way to display information. So have a lot of fun with it. And um, until next week. <laughs>